Hey babes, welcome and welcome back. It's your girl Midnight Moon and today we're going to be giving a little update on how my one month experience went with the Exuviance Pure Retinol Correcting Peel. I'm also going to be sharing my thoughts on two other products which are the Exuviance Radiance Serum and the Exuviance Age Reverse Hydrofirm Cream. So this is a big anti-aging line and on the side of acne prone and blemish problem skin as well as hyperpigmentation so if you guys are interested in any one of those things or you just want to learn a little bit more about these products to try them out for yourselves then make sure you keep on watching please don't forget to join my beauty youtube family here hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new videos show your support and give this video a huge thumbs up don't forget to share it with friends and leave a comment and let me know if you guys have tried any products like these. Without further ado, let's get into it. Don't give up about paparazzi, baby. You know they always trying to give me a million dollars at the night scene. So first disclaimers, this video is sponsored somewhat. Um, I did get these products gifted to me, but I did already do my review on Instagram. Um, which was required for this campaign, but my reviews are always 100% honest and authentically me because my skin is me, as you guys always know, and your skin is yours. We are not all the same, and I'm not going to damage my skin or mess it up more with products that don't work. I'm not going to do that to you guys either. So I'm here with my one month update on these products. These were gifted with now no obligation to review on any other platform but Instagram. Um, and I'm just going to be sharing my thoughts and a little bit more about these products. So I am going to have all product mentions links down in the description box below. So please check that out. I'm going to talk a little bit more about each one of these products products and while we're there on each product we're going to be sharing my thoughts and opinions so here we go opinions. the first product we have is the pure retinol correcting peel now these do come in a pack of six for the full size i got four to try out and they're 72 dollars for the six count now, as a treatment, I don't think that's too bad because you're not going to use these forever. You're not using them every single day. These are weekly treatment pads to help correct your skin. And to let you know a little bit more about this product, Exuviance Pure Retinol Correcting Peel is an intensive correcting peel with 0.3% high strength pure retinol and 10% citrophil, which rejuvenates visible signs of aging, dark spots, uneven skin tone, pores and lines for instant skin resurfacing, renewal, and visible firming. The benefits formulated with a high strength level of 0.3% 3 .3 pure retinol, a proven anti-aging powerhouse ingredient plus citrophil to support skin's natural collagen. Clinical results, percentage of respondents noting visible improvements after only four once weekly applications, 100% skin is resurfaced and firmer, 97% lines are less apparent, skin color is more even, and 94% dark spots and pores are less apparent. Again, this is a weekly treatment, so you use it once a week. It's more recommended to use at night because you do leave it on. You don't want to wash this peel off unless you're feeling very sensitive to it. And retinol does make your skin, especially because it is a peel, it will make your skin a bit more sensitive to the sun. So try to limit your sun exposure. Wear your SPF. 30 or higher and this also does contain glycerin um alcohol as the first ingredient that is the point of the retinol peel part um i do have to say they did say you may experience some flaking of the skin i did not experience that personally i think because i already use ahas phas um bhas and all that good stuff i've been using it for about a year now um i don't mix them i'm just saying i do use them um, don't mix them because you can't use certain ingredients. But because I've been exfoliating and really taking care of my skin, I don't probably have as much dead skin as someone would um, looking into these peels. And they don't exfoliate or they're new to peels and exfoliation. So onto my thoughts. This does smell very, very, very strongly of alcohol. It does not dry out your skin. I automatically thought it would because it smelled like alcohol and that was the first ingredient. But there is glycerin and I 
believe there's other moisturizing ingredients in here as well. Um, I also did notice it after it dried down on my face. It left a kind of serum-like texture on my face, which they said to massage in, and I did, and it made my complexion look so nice and glowy. Um, for the four weeks use, I think it did a good job. Um, I can't give it 100% because I still have a lot of hyperpigmentation. I can say for this peel, I did notice that firmer skin, which everybody noticed in the clinical trials. I did also notice a little bit of the hyperpigmentation reduced and my congested uh, skin. So I would definitely recommend, I would have to probably use for the full six weeks to really know if this would help with the hyperpigmentation because like I said, I haven't seen a huge, huge difference. But as for giving a nice youthful appearance, um, kind of lifting the skin, making it firmer, looking more bouncy, that did a amazing job. My skin also did feel a lot smoother, even from the first use all the way down to the last use. I'd have to give these a good four stars. Now I do want to say um, I don't think these would benefit sensitive, very sensitive skin. Um, because it is a retinol peel and it's pure strength, it's stabilized retinol, um, this may not be the best for sensitive skin. I don't have sensitive skin. Um, I have blemish-prone skin. Uh, but besides that, yeah, um, it worked great on my skin. I really loved it for the four weeks. And is it something I would repurchase? Yes, definitely. Now, the next product we're going to get into is the Exuviance Radiance Serum. This serum is another $72, which I think is kind of hefty on price. But this pairs very well with the peel. So if you're going to get the peel, I really recommend this with that. So benefits contains a 9% bionic and polyhydroxy acid PHA complex to visibly improve seven signs of photo aging, including loss of firmness, dullness, rough texture, lines and wrinkles, and large pores and e uneven skin tone. This clinically developed formulation is designed to empower skin with enhanced exfoliation for a smoother, more luminous complexion. Infused with a multivitamin complex and marine botanical, this anti-aging serum has been shown to boost youthful radiance by 212%. It does also say supercharge your daily skincare regimen with this concentrated problem-solving essential. Clinical results. Percentage of respondents noting improvement after 12 weeks of twice daily use. 96% improved skin texture and smoothness. 85% improved appearance of fine lines. Clinical results show for percentage of respondents noting improvements after 12 weeks of twice daily use, 96% improved skin texture and smoothness, and 85% improved appearance of fine lines. Now, there are also a couple of key ingredients. There's gluconolactone, which is a PHA, lactobionic acid, another PHA, mandelic acid, which is an AHA, vitamins A, C, and E, and marine botanical. Now, I really enjoyed this serum using it. I did have to recently stop using it because I use, I started using other products um, and ingredients that shouldn't be mixed with retinol. Um, retinol is vitamin A, just so you guys know. But once I'm finished with those products, I'm definitely going to hop back on this because I love this serum. Um, I give it a good four stars. It is quite thick. So if you don't like thick serums, I would advise to mix this into like your moisturizer or honestly, it goes amazing with the peel. Um, amazing. After you put the peel on and the serum absorbs in, when you put this on, it makes it so smooth. It feels so nice. It feels like baby soft skin and it just looks so more plump. It looks very, very glowy. Um, so you have a nice dewy look. This is how it looks. It's It has a greenish hue to it. I'm just going to rub it on our hand so you guys can see. And you guys see that glow already. Also, because this does contain retinol, remember again, and PHAs, please wear your SPF in the morning if you're going to wear this. Me personally, I only use this at night. Um, again, I use salicylic acid and a ton of other ingredients in the morning that should not be mixed with retinol. So my retinol stays to PM use. But see, that is a beautiful luminous glow. 
Um, it doesn't feel heavy on my hand. This probably doesn't pair well in my experience with other serums. I noticed it would get like really sticky or just feel really heavy on the skin. But if you're going to use this serum alone, again, like after the peel or just this serum alone in your routine and you're not layering serums, then I would definitely recommend this. It does have a very, 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 very light scent. Nothing strong um, and nothing irritating to the nose. It's also not irritating on my skin personally because I am blemish prone. On to the last product, guys. This is the Age Reverse Hydrofirm Hyaluronic Acid Anti-Aging Moisturizer. This retails for $79. I received two of the sample sizes and I haven't finished the first full one again because I do use other ingredients that shouldn't be mixed with certain things. Um, but I am going to hop back on this one as well. And it's an intensely hydrating moisturizer with hyaluronic acid. This comfort-rich moisturizing cream replenishes optimal hydration levels and contains a unique combination of multitasking age-reverse ingredients that targets the look of aging skin, including dehydration, poor texture, and uneven skin tone and wrinkles. Hyaluronic acid acts as a moisture sponge to quench dryness at skin surface, while the NMF natural moisturizing natural moisturizing factor formula infuses skin with crucial amino acids and sugars to help restore youthful moisture and make skin less vulnerable to dryness specially formulated with a retexturizing blend of bionic and neoglucosamine this anti-aging cream provides noticeable smoothing and brightening effects while also helping to reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles the multi antioxidant formula also targets daily environmental stressors to help ensure a youthful appearance. Renew youthful hydration, radiance, and luminosity. Clinical results show percentage of respondents noting improvement after four weeks of twice daily use. 97% skin feels hydrated, 94% smoother skin texture, 84% skin is brighter, more luminous. Um, again, key ingredients, hyaluronic acid, NMF, amino acids, and antioxidants. I only use this at night, and then I like to focus on my anti-aging at night. So what I can say for this is it's really good. I really haven't noticed too much of a difference. For me, it's like a basic moisturizer. I'm going to show you how it looks. It has a kind of greenish hue. This one smells so spa and luxury-like. It smells absolutely amazing. I love how it feels on my skin. Again, this is another great pairing to go with the peel and the serum. Like if you just wanted to use those products alone, you could. And that would be your skincare for life. Like, well, not the peel pads. You don't want to use that forever. It might damage your skin, but this is how it's looking over the serum. It makes the skin feel so smooth. That is definitely something I noticed. So smooth and silky. Um, it leaves a beautiful radiance glow behind along with the serum, um, and it's just gorgeous. Again, it smells so spa and luxury-like, like you would think you're getting a facial at home, like you just went to the salon. It's just, it's wonderful, guys. Again, I would say it's a little hefty in price, but I don't mind hefty prices. If a product works, it works. Like said, I didn't really notice too much of a difference with this, but I didn't use it for the full amount of time. Um, so I will definitely be giving an update in my stories when I start using this again on Instagram. So follow me there, guys. So I did take before and after pictures, guys, but don't come at me because I kind of messed them up. I didn't realize my backdrop with the lighting that was going on for the first two weeks um, didn't go well together. It was actually making my hyperpigmentation and my skin, it was just making it look a lot more clear when it wasn't. Like, you guys, if you can see in the camera how my skin looks right now, um, it's, I have a lot of acne, hyperpigmentation, hormonal acne, cystic acne, blackheads, congested pores, which we've been working on. Um, so just keep that in mind. The first two uh, weeks, pictures weren't that good, but you will see the third week and fourth weeks. All right, guys. So that is the end of this video. I hope I could give you some good info on these products and I hope I could help you make a decision on whether to buy these or not, or if these are for you and your skin type. 
please let me know in the comments below what you thought of these products if you're gonna go buy them do you have the same skin concerns i do i'd like to know and would you like to see more videos like this uh we will see you guys here next week on thursday at 11 a.m as always and as always y'all stay beautifully awesome later